had some early morning deliveries come through and thought we'd do a little unboxing. So this first one is from Moa Shop. They're like a Sydney-based next day Korean food delivery service. I feel like this is one of the most exciting discoveries I've made in 2021. Ordered a whole bunch of Korean groceries yesterday and we're gonna do a little grocery haul. So this is my little grocery haul. The first thing that I got is a whole lot of chicken breast. You guys know I'm working out and I'm trying to reduce my body fat percentage by four to five percent because only then I'll actually start to see some muscle definition. Right now, I have some muscle but it's covered by a layer of fat. So got me some chicken breast. This is from the brand Suvi Donalds. I got it in the plain flavor, roasted garlic flavor, herb and olive oil flavor, and mala flavor. This is the one I'm most excited about. It's just gonna taste so good. Woo! Next up, I got some vegan bread from the brand Dear Bread. I love Korean diet food options because I just feel like there's so much more variety. It tastes really good. These ones are only 150 calories per serving, and that's like a whole chocolate cake. So very excited to try these. This one is chocolate vegan pound cake. Green tea chocolate chip vegan pound cake. And also the chocolate coconut vegan pound cake. Got some cognac jelly. I used to get these from the convenience stores all the time in Korea because they're only like four to seven calories. They're zero sugar. And I got one of each flavor. So this is pomegranate, apple lychee, mango, grapefruit, peach, grape, and also yogurt flavor. These are really good for when you're having afternoon cravings because you still get to eat something and it's still sweet, but there's not that many calories. I got some bisukaru. If you guys don't know what it is, it's basically a combination of different roasted grains powdered, and then you can add water or milk to it and it just tastes really good. It's like a nutty kind of milkshake and this is from the brand Nongsan Green. I don't know why but grocery hauls give me so much happiness. Next up, these are from the brand Omi Berry and I got their berry tea and also berry sparkling. I may have gotten these because the bottle is pretty but also very excited to try them. Finally, I also ordered some ready-made meals. I got some takgobi from PR Korean restaurant in Lidkum. If you guys remember, I've actually been to this restaurant before in my vlogs. It's like one of the few places in Sydney that does legit Korean style takgobi. I now have it delivered straight to my door which is amazing. I also got kamjatang. This is like pork backbone, I think. Pork backbone stew. So good. One of my favorite Korean stews. And all I need to do is just heat this up. So super excited to try this as well. I also ordered a dakamari set from Young Station. And this is just like a, um, a chicken soup. And it also comes with my favorite noodles. So excited to try everything out. This is a whole haul I've got going on over here. Pretty sure they only service the Sydney area. So if my Sydney viewers wanted to take a note, this is their site, moshop.com.au. And they do have a Korean and an English version. So if you don't read Korean, you can still buy off their site. I'm just so happy with everything I got. Moving on to the next box. Another exciting delivery from the Bubble Tea Club. The boxes are always so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. If you guys remember a couple of vlogs ago, I was in Rebel Sports just trying to look for a nice black cap that I could wear to the gym when I work out. And everything that I found was just like a washed out kind of black. It wasn't actually black. And so they messaged me and asked me if they could send me their cap because their cap is actually black. Thank you so much. I will actually wear this to go to the gym. Look at that. And it says bubble tea club on this side. Their mascot on the other. Some more tea. Some more tapioca pearls, of course. Some more fruit syrups. More fructose syrup as well. I am literally stuck for life, guys. Today is my brother's birthday and we ordered him a gelato cake. My dad was just gonna drive there and pick it up himself, but since I'm working towards my peas, I'm going to drive there. I think it'll be like a 30 to 40 minute drive. I've never driven anywhere so far before. I've only been driving through the little streets in my suburb. So we're gonna see how this goes. Oh 
platter. Best time ordering from here. this takamari that I got from Moa shop. It comes with some kaiguksu and sujebi as well. But since I'm cooking for five people, I prepared some extra kaiguksu over here as well as some tak because this in takamari is just amazing. Put this in the pan. in the afternoon <laughs> we're in Bondi and this Asian auntie next to me is working really hard to find us parking even all the paid parking spots are full like ticketed parking so I don't know what we're going to do oh my god it's so pretty here there oh this person is so lucky is she leaving or she she's parking Ugh. you worked hard Vincy <laughs> finally found us parking <laughs> This is what we've been looking forward to all day. Yes. <laughs> literally just found out that Brandy Melville is in Australia. <laughs> what the heck? When did it happen? Like, oh, a long time ago. What? Yeah. I didn't know there was a Brandy in Australia. Oh, I really like them. Everything in here is super cute, guys. For anyone else in Sydney who, like me, didn't know that this place existed, it is in Bondi Westfield. Highly recommend. Everything is super nice. Yes to the shorts, but and then, then the sleeve on this a is bit a bit too, too long. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you kind of look like um like a Girl Scout. <laughs> Girl Scout bag. Oh, it's cute. You have to get this one. You have to get this. It's not good to come with a friend to be like, oh, you have to get it. It looks good there. You look really pretty today, I just want to say. No, oh my god. It's cute. I have a lovely day. See ya. I got her to buy four pieces. <laughs> How do you feel? Happy, but also broke. <laughs> broke? Don't worry, okay? It was an investment into your fashion. 
I just had some salad for dinner because I ate so much yesterday. I'm trying to balance it out. But now I'm just really hungry again. I've been having one of these cognac jellies that I got yesterday. This one is apple flavor because I was out in the sun all day today and it was really hot and sweaty. My face, especially around this area, just feels really oily and congested. I'm going to be doing a little clay mask to just clear out all the gunk in my face. This is the Australian Pink Clay Pore Fining Face Mask from Sun and Sky. This is made right here in Australia and it has a 4 in 1 formula to basically just draw out impurities, tighten the pores, invigorate the skin and also boost radiance this is what the pink clay looks like inside just put on a little headband so my hair won't get in the way and we are gonna apply this in our face i really love the little brush that it comes with this does tingle a little when you apply it but it doesn't irritate the skin at all and i have dry sensitive skin but if you have oily to combination skin you can use this like two to three times a week Applying some on our forehead and we are pretty much done. If you guys didn't know, Australian Pink Clay is really good for its ability to purify the skin and tighten the pores. So this is going to do wonders. It has been 10 minutes. I'm gonna go wash this off now and I will see you guys very soon. Ta-da! Wash the mask off with some warm water and my skin feels so clean right now. It just feels like everything has been sucked out. You can really see that it visibly tightens your pores, which is very satisfying. And my face is also looking a lot brighter. Very rejuvenated right now. If you guys wanted to check this out, I do have a discount code for you guys. You can just enter Nessie at checkout for 10% off site-wide. Highly recommend, guys. I will leave a link down below i'm gonna finish up on the rest of my skincare i've showed you guys this part already so if you haven't watched it yet i will also have that video linked down below see you guys tomorrow morning having brunch with alina sitting across from me thank you wow wow look at it so big oh my god thank you like too lavendery. Alina got a lavender iced coffee. Very nice. Are you guys seeing this? It's peanut butter flavor, right? I love peanut butter. And it's like crusted the bread. Guys, earlier I was like, let's get this chia pudding, and she was like, that looks so healthy <laughs> in a derogatory way. But it's really good, yeah. right? Every single I'm the time, biggest fruit auntie. I want to order something healthy. <laughs> like she'll be like, that looks so healthy, though. And then you like it. <laughs> okay, yeah. Because usually I don't like um chia pudding. Yeah. I'm really excited because after this, we're going yes. to a cat cafe. Yay! We found this cat cafe a couple weeks ago, and we've been wanting to go ever since. But the weather's just been so bad. So now that this fine yeah. yeah. So I know. Let's try the cinnamon scroll. Yeah. <laughs> this is in my top five foods of all time. Cinnamon rolls. Like, you know Cinnabon, right? Mm. That's probably like, one of my favorite places ever. Oh my gosh. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> That's like, exactly like Cinnabon. Mm. Alina's looking a bit emotional right now. <laughs> From the cinnamon scroll. You know in Ratatouille when the food critic eats the ratatouille and then he has like a flashback to his childhood. That's how I feel right now. Made it to the cat cafe. Hi, hey, meow. Waiting for our session. Mm. You pay ten dollars to play with the cats for thirty minutes, which, which is really it'll always be worth it. In Korea, like you can literally go into like a cat cafe or like a dog cafe and buy like a coffee. Like the coffee will be like three dollars, yeah, four dollars, yeah. and then you, you get to <laughs> unlimited time yeah. with the dogs or cats. Thank you. Oh my god. Hi. 
Oh my god, it's like eating your bag. <laughs> you can get in my bag, it's fine. Hi! Oh my god! I swear, oh, this is I just fight you, I promise. half an hour of us begging for their <laughs> yeah, attention. Yeah. This is how desperate we are. Meows to attract cats. <laughs> Oh my god, it worked, guys! You're never getting all the attention. I know. Make your cat happy with soothing cat music. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hi! Well, maybe it is the music. I really like this music. <gasps> <laughs> Literally, after we come outside, the cat finally shows interest in us. Thanks for ignoring us for half an hour. Nyam. They paid money to literally just like get rejected. Get rejected for half an hour. <laughs> literally, we got more attention from these two corgis than we did in the entire cat cafe. This is true. <laughs> 